Well, another day of uh, Calgary Flames training camp 2.0 and uh, pleased to be joined by defenseman Eric Gustafson here after uh, the skate. And uh, Eric, maybe first of all, just give us an idea of what uh, what the first few days of camp have been like here. Um, obviously a little bit different for you. You weren't in the uh, first, the original training camp with the Calgary Flames, but uh, you know, a little different this time around. Yeah, it is. Uh, it's always fun to come back with, train with the boys here. Uh, uh, it's It's been tough the first couple of days here, but uh, uh, I think we all uh, uh, are coming into it. Uh, we have hard practicing, but uh, I think I think uh, everyone's looking good out there, and uh, it's it's fun to be back. How much uh, were you able to skate over the break, and uh, maybe just give us an idea of what it uh, what what the body feels like as you kind of get through the first few days here? Uh, I've actually been on the ice uh, quite a uh, quite some time uh, back home. Uh, I've been been skating with a couple guys uh, younger guys too uh, and uh, trying to find uh, every ice I could uh, back home but uh, uh, I've been here now for a week and a half and uh, I feel almost uh, almost that I can come back to the normal spot but uh, it's just the breeding here it's uh, got to come, come through but uh, uh, it's, it's a good start from the camp here. What is it like for for you? I mean, you get acquired at the trade deadline. You're just starting to settle in. I think you end up finishing with just seven games as a member of the Calgary Flames, and yet it feels like so long ago. It feels like you've been part of the team for over a year. Uh, I mean, obviously, it's not something you've gone through before, but does it feel like you're coming right back, to picking up where you left off? Or, um, you know, maybe just describe that it, it's been a small time as far as actually being with the team, and yet a long time, if that makes any sense at all. Uh, yeah, yes, like I said, uh, we were on the, uh, on the road, uh, first two weeks when I um, got traded. Uh, then uh, uh, I was here, I, I was probably living in uh, Calgary for a week or something like that until they shut it down. And uh, uh, But uh, no, I feel like I uh, coming back uh, as to the, to the normal, uh, to, to feeling good again. Uh, just, uh, just like I said before, it's just the breeding and the attitude here and uh, it's, it's a little bit hard, but uh, it, it's coming through. How's the uh, the communication with teammates over the course of the break, too? It sounded like lots of guys, um, you know, keeping those group messages going. I would I would assume that uh, that helped as well as uh, over the course of that break. It, it did, yeah, for sure. Uh, uh, yeah, we got a lot of Swedes, so it's uh, we talked a lot of back home uh, over the break, and uh, uh, we have that team uh, team chat too. So uh, it was it was uh, we have a lot of. Uh, conversation and a lot of <laughs> a lot of uh, text back and forth but uh felt like um uh, felt good uh, i was just following back uh, all the all the things he was doing so uh but uh, uh it's it's fun always fun to come back here I, I know there was a lot of uncertainty over the course of that those last few months but were you able to take advantage of the time off in terms of family time and just uh, you know kind of getting a sense of uh, of a break from hockey for a little bit i did yeah uh I don't think I've been uh, with the family so much uh, uh, the last, uh, like I uh, like I have uh, in the last uh, three or four months. Uh, it's it's been it's been fun. Uh, uh, I got two kids, so uh, it's always fun to be with the family, and play with them, and stuff like that. So uh, it's been uh, it's been tough uh, to be away from hockey, but uh, it's always fun to be with the family too. Uh, how old are your kids again? Uh, one is two and a half, and uh, one is ten months. Oh yeah, so keeping you busy for sure. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> uh, it just you know when you come back here, I know that a lot of be you know talked about in terms of what you guys are getting ready for, and it's completely different uh, from a normal training camp in terms of uh, the types of games you're going to play once we get out of this, uh, which is that qualifying round. But for all intents and purposes, it's it's basically playoff hockey. I mean, what is that feeling like in that locker room, knowing you know what's ahead and maybe that opportunity to seize it? Well, everyone is exciting. Um, exciting. Uh, it's just uh, it's very important games. The the first uh, qualifying round is just five games, so uh, it's it's uh, it's a battle from the start, and uh, it's always it's gonna be fun to play against Edmonton there too first. So uh, I never played against Edmonton here in Calgary, so it's it's gonna be fun. Looking forward to it. Uh, we appreciate the time and uh, all the best as training camp rolls on. Well, I'm sure we'll talk to you again soon. Uh, socially distanced, of course. Exactly, yeah. Thanks, Eric. Thank you.